Okay, ladies and gents, uh, back with the third installment of the Voodoo Project, which is a DIY pulse induction metal detector with iron rejection. So today, you can see here, we're going to be reviewing the uh, display and the functionality of the different buttons that are associated with it. It's just a, a run-of-the-mill 16 by 2 display. You can see it's backlit. Um, one thing that I, I will mention, the contrast adjustment potentiometer, you have to get it exactly right in there in order to get any sort of reading on here that's discernible. I initially thought that the uh, first screen was was bad because I, I was getting absolutely nothing. I had to go almost to the very end of the pot before I, I got a reading on the display. So I'm going to zoom out here and, and show you the uh, temporary button setup that I have and we'll go from there. So temporary button setup, pretty simple, four buttons, they're momentary. Uh, so top one is menu, enter, up, and down and we'll just uh, take a quick spin through here and we'll see what the display looks like so here's the home screen right you hit the menu button once and we're now in uh, detecting mode pulse as you can see to go into shift into hybrid mode you hit either up or down so we're now in hybrid mode. I hit up once again. I'm back in pulse mode. Now to run through the various settings of pulse mode, you hit enter once. Okay. All these values here that you'll see, the numerical values, they're, they're all adjustable. And we're just going to run through them. So thresholds you can see I just adjusted it up a little bit by hitting up hit the down button come back down alright to advance in the menu hit enter once and now we're on to pulse width default value there's 140 microseconds advance to the next value hit enter once Sample delay, you can see default value is 27 microseconds. Like I said, this is adjustable. Hit enter, sample pulse width, enter again. PI average, that's the average of the uh, different arrays. And we're back to detecting mode pulse. Shift into hybrid by hitting the up button and if we hit enter we can run through essentially the same menu except it's for the hybrid version sample delay sample pulse width disk average uh, meter zero and counter limit and we are still in hybrid mode so to go back to pulse we either hit the up or down button and now we're back in pulse mode and to exit we hit menu once alright guys that's it quick and dirty and we'll be on with the uh, the PI preamp next